Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Lady Survival here. Today is April 1st, and that means that it is time to go after the new April trading post things in World of Warcraft. I'm logging on right now. I haven't even checked it out yet to see all of the goodies that are currently available. Um, I think I saw some posts on like Instagram. A few creators that I follow will usually make like a little reel kind of showing some stuff that's available, but I didn't really like watch it watch it so for the most part it's gonna be a total surprise really excited to uh, grab everything with you guys and see what uh, little achievement things I'm gonna go for to get all of my coins for this month I'm also wearing a blue wig today um, I was talking in my discord to a few of my girly friends about how I want to dye my hair blue um, this isn't quite the shade that I want to actually dye it this is a little bit more of like a light blue kind of like minty-ish um, but the blue that I want is definitely quite a bit darker but it's the vibes of blue hair I felt like doing that so yeah got the fancy uh, blue wig on and we are gonna jump over to uh, World of Warcraft here we are uh, I'm on my main character uh, one of my friends from my discord also gifted me this dreadlord transmog set so thank you so much uh, dead soul xo for gifting this to me uh, we're going to be heading over to the trading post. We're going to start by just kind of, you know, checking out all of the rewards and stuff that we can get for this month. I'm really, really excited. All right, let's grab our, our catch for the month. 500 traders tender. Report to the trading post. Okay, let's see what we got. I'd like to see what we have. Cool. I did see this. I saw World of Warcraft promoting this, the Dreadwake mount. I'll probably definitely get this one because I never did get around to getting that before oh my god the treasure trove from like the plunder storm very cool wow I guess it all makes sense now why we were getting all of this like pirate stuff it was all for the plunder storm oh my god we definitely got some silly ones lots of pirate hats it would be so cute if my hair was showing but I don't want to be bald okay I already have that so what is this? Oh, it is. This is all Plunderstorm themed. Cool, cool. Uh, standard catalog. Let's see. Oh, wow. That's pretty cute. Oh my god. Could you imagine if you could see the hair? I really, really like that one. Another mount. See, I feel like I kind of would want this, but I also want this. And then there's no way I'm going to have enough. Oh man. Okay, that's kind of cool. I do like that also. It's very interesting how it like shapes around her uh, booty area there. Wow, those are kind of interesting. Sun hat. Hmm. I like that. That's pretty cool. Yeah, so far I am most intrigued. What is that? What even is a back item? What the hell? That is so cool. It's like little uh, vials and like kind of not darts, but that's fucking dope. Uh, knives and poison at the ready that is awesome very cool very green longbow that is ugly okay oh there, there's a parasol again i don't know why they don't show what it looks like that is really pretty really like that got a little spell book boring oh we got the color green now hey those are kind of cool ish i mean they're interesting uh, what do we got next? Eh, don't really care. That's pretty cool. Purple tabard. Boring. Boring. Meh. Purple gloves. Oh my god, see, I probably need those. Of all the colors that they've come up with so far, I don't have the purple ones. I don't really care about the skirts. They're not that cool. Uh, what is this? Two hand. Oh, interesting. Okay, got some hatchets. Still not a fan. Ooh, but they got it in purple. Okay, that's pretty cool. I never really liked these duelers cape things, but in full on purple, that is pretty awesome. Boring belt. Meh, also kind of boring. All right, cool. Well, now we kind of know what's all here. Uh, I think I want the the boat, like the Dreadwakes pirate ship boat thing the most. Uh, next thing to check out is, yeah, let's see what things that we're going to want to do. I'm probably going to pull up my uh, notepad so I can start to uh, 
write down whichever ones I think that I might be interested in doing. Let's make this a little bit smaller. Does not need to be that big. Okay, what are we going to want to do? Complete 10 quests. I'll just put complete quests because I know it like keeps going. Like you can do like more quests, like 25 quests or whatever. Oh my god, it is Noble Garden. I haven't been doing really any of the holiday event stuff because I finished the what a long strange trip it's been, which is that meta achievement to do all of the holiday things a few years back. So I just don't really do much. Collect brightly colored eggs, 30 of them. Eat Noble Garden chocolates. Okay. Yeah, we'll kind of have like a an Easter themed thing uh, going on here. Oh, what even is, is this a pet? Aura. Aura. Cute. Oh my god. Uh, use spring flowers in an arena or battleground. Doesn't sound too bad. I could easily just queue for a battleground, right? I don't usually do any like of the PvP type ones, but... I don't even know how to get the spring flowers, but we will figure that out in Battleground for 100. Uh, complete two daily quests. Complete the duck storyline only for 50 points. Nah. I don't know where that is. It must be like an open world thing. I don't know if I've ever done that before. Um, I don't want to do the dungeons. Don't want to do the honor. I'm not a crafter. Not going to do arenas. There we go. The 15 pet battles. That is up my alley. I think that everyone always does that because it's just so easy. Oh my god, slash bounce at critters. That could be fun. I mean, uh, I feel like it would take a while, but it probably wouldn't be that bad. I'd probably just have to Google where they all are and do that. Slash bounce at critters. We can maybe do the 25 dungeon bosses. This is pretty much how I always do it. I don't know how other people do it. They might just get started, but I like to write a little list of everything that I plan to do. World boss for 100. That's easy. While we're doing the critters, we can do that. I'm kind of like combining these two. If I do it, I'll get 200. Defeat raid bosses. I usually like when they have the one where it's like level up as like this class, like get 10 levels as certain classes. It doesn't look like that's one on here though. So guess we're not gonna do that one. Let's uh, probably start with the pet battles, I'm thinking. Probably the best way to go. I did a stream event just on Saturday to do the glory of the Argus Raider, and I'm getting so many people messaging me who weren't able to come, and they're like, I still need that mount. Uh, uh, so we are gonna do all of our battle pets and stuff, and I'll probably just kind of zoom through this part. It's kind of boring. Last time when I did a video uh, showing me doing all of these things, I feel like I made it too long. Um, so this time, instead of like talking my way through the whole thing, we're just going to go ahead and kind of, I'll probably just skip to the end and be like, yay, I got my 15 pets. So I was out and about obviously doing my battle pets and stuff. And then I guess that I found the spot where that guy is going to spawn. Um, I don't even know how you say his name, but whatever the thing is where you got to kill the guy for Noble Garden, I found the spot. Uh, Daytan Swift Plume. Uh, there's like this large duck thing and I see his dead body so I guess that he'll be here anytime now so that's cool um there's also another battle pet over here so I'll go grab that and then we're waiting for him so we can get 50 of our tender as well wow oh my god what is that is this how it happens oh shit is it happening what the hell I've never done this before this is uh is this new because <laughs> weren't ducks like a thing that were added in dragonflight Wow, I'm glad I came back. I was like doing some pet battles because they were nearby, but I was like, I really don't want to miss this. I don't know how quick it is. Are they going to give druids like a duck form? I could see it because he's like a night elf and he came in as a duck. That's pretty cool. All right. <laughs> Quacked killer. All right. What do we get? Is there like cool loots? Aha! Uh, the trinket appears to be a noble garden decoration of sorts. You should return this to the festivities at Razor Hill. Cool. Yeah, I mean, I guess maybe we'll do like a combination of pet battles while also making our way over to Razor Hill to do all of the the stuff. Because I know we had a lot down for like gathering eggs. I kind of forget what everything was that we're going to do, but I'll just get the few pets that are around here as well. All right, so we have to collect 30 eggs and I guess we'll also have to get some chocolates and then find out how to get the spring flowers and do some daily quests as well. So I'm pretty sure that all of this will probably happen 
pretty quickly once we get to Razor Hill and just start doing them. We already only need three more pet battles. We are getting there. Super, super close. It's been forever since I've been here. Ooh, and we get flight stones from this too? Hell yeah. Scare off 10 ducks using the horn of honking. Oh my god, that is so funny. Wow, there's fucking bunnies everywhere. All right, yeah, isn't there like eggs just like around, I think? Okay, we're gonna scare the ducks away. That is so funny. I remember running around doing this with my husband, just like all the Easter stuff. Um, yeah, see, look, there's an egg. Look, someone got the egg. I'm too slow. Or wait, was that a real person? No, that was just a uh, NPC. I was like, it's a real person who's a bunny. Gotta look for these eggs. I think we're supposed to get 30 of them. Oh my god, what a vibe here. I'm gonna bring this horn down here so I don't have to have my bags open here. Okay, seven more eggs. This is a super easy one. If you guys are going to do this for April, I mean, there's even a lot of people around. I don't know if they're just like slow or what, but like, I feel like there's people like camping the egg spots, but it's like they're AFK or something. I'm just getting all of them. Come on. Is this our last one or maybe one more? Ah, there we go. We got it. Okay. We got our brightly colored eggs. I'm going to go ahead and remove that one. Collect your 30 eggs hell yeah i know that doing some daily quests is a thing i guess i should have picked those up before i didn't even see them i wonder if there's like a daily quest to uh collect the eggs but we're gonna see golden heirloom was among the items stolen Let's see what daily quests do we all got here collect 20 shell fragments ah during your egg collection do i have to collect more eggs see i totally wasn't even thinking go hunting for brightly colored eggs see oh my god my quest log is full i totally should have uh just go get more eggs why not what was that thing don't we need yeah spring flowers i have to get the spring flowers so that i can use them for something else. God, look at how cute some of this stuff is. Oh, so I guess I can open all of the eggs. See, I forgot how all of this works. Look at that. <gasps> We're getting so many things. So I guess that this is kind of going towards my, uh, my questing and we're getting items. Wow. It's been so long since I've like participated in like holiday stuff. You know, this is really fun. It's easy. It's working. It was all worth it, guys. It's like I did the, the pre-work to, uh, to get there. It's a rabbit costume on someone. That's dope. Oh, we did it. Complete two daily quests. Okay, so we can also remove that. Uh, and then I think that it like keeps going. Like I can probably do more daily quests now. Awesome. So we're already at 200 and I'm about to finish the pet battles as well, which will bring us up to 400. It did give us another quest though over here to go and talk to someone in Orgrimmar. So I'm going to get back on... Oh, I can't use my mount as a bunny. I'm going to go finish off these pet battles over here. Let's see, I think that this was the last one. If not, maybe one more. Yep. Okay. We got our 15 pet battles. Oh, oh my God. So that's what that is. Complete the duck storyline. It is totally a new thing. It's like a dragon flight thing. Tell her that I didn't become an arc mage simply to deal with such trivial things. Okay. Take this potion, drink it, and you should be able to chit chat with those feathery fiends. Okay. Gather some information. Quack. Is that all you got for me? Go steal those eggs. Don't blow my cover. Oh my god, this is hilarious. I guess I should be just gathering eggs anyways because I need to get enough chocolate to be able to buy the spring flowers so that I can even do that battleground thing too. And this ridiculous festival of colorful eggs. Colored eggs, okay. Look at it, it's so cute. Look at me go. The little fast legs. Okay, we're almost there. Hey, this is the spot where everyone's killing them. I think they're killing him right now. Hey guys, that's my leader. Okay, found the golden egg. Oh my god. Okay, so I guess that this is the end of the quest line. So this was another thing to do. I don't think I wrote it down. One of the things that I was going to do, but that was pretty easy. Black duck disguise. Pink duck. Oh my god, how do I pick? I'll probably be a pink duck. I feel like that's like the closest to purple. Oh my god. Scare off 10 ducks. Okay, I guess we can do another daily quest, so why not? <laughs> Oof. Just, you know, just opening my mail, a bunch of stuff that I couldn't pick up when uh, my bags were hella full. Okay, all right, so we have 63 eggs, so I think that we have enough now. I'm gonna buy, what, is it spring flowers? Is that what it is? Use spring flowers in a battleground. Okay, so we're gonna buy the spring flowers. 
Okay, so we only need three more daily quests, but I think that we've done all of them for today, so I might revisit that tomorrow. We're almost done the 10 quests because the daily quests count as quests as well, so that's awesome. Okay, eat 10 Noble Garden chocolates. That's what that is, right? Okay, in Iskara. Okay, so we're gonna head to the Dragon Isles next. We're gonna go do a world boss. We're gonna eat the chocolates, and then I'll probably do the critter thing to where we have to... Uh, bounce on all of the critters. So maybe I'll look up a guide on that. Okay, cool. Got a little quest when we came in here. That's like some plunderstorm thing, but hey, that's gonna count as getting some quests done, so that's good. Um, let's start by killing a world boss. Looks like there is one over here. So we are gonna go over to the world boss, but also I wanna check, okay, this one, slash bounce at critters on the Dragon Isles. I'm going to, I went and downloaded the TomTom Tom add-on because I don't know how to use it. I've never used it before, but it looks like this person has the TomTom uh, Tom cords. I also went and heated up my coffee and look, my mug like matches my hair. This is like a little funny uh, Christmas cat mug that my mother-in-law got me. It says Meowy Christmas and they're like little cats wearing hats. So there's another, uh, thing that I need. Okay, I'm guessing it's that one. Okay, we're gonna open up WoW again. I'm learning, guys. I'm trying to do this. Details. Paste. Right? Paste. Is this working? Is this how this works? Like, look, there's like a thing. There is a thing on my map. What the hell? I've never done this before, so I am, uh, very intrigued. It says that we're getting closer. Where? Oh my god, right here? Okay, so let's see. Can I slash bounce is that how that works like did that just i don't even i don't even know how the pace thing knew to like do that for me but let's see if it worked oh my god look it worked what the hell i got one of them i feel like this tom tom thing it's genius how did it know maybe i can try look slash target where is he oh shit he's over here okay slash bounce yep okay we did it okay now we can head to the next one i'm getting the hang of this now i'll just have to pay attention to the names of what they are i can't believe like guys if you're gonna do this achievement get tom tom get that paste thing and paste it in from that post um maybe i'll like put it in my description because i didn't know that that was a thing i had no idea oh slash tt paste opens a window where you can paste them that explains so much. Is that how that works? Did I even need? Oh shit, we're on the boss. We're on the boss. <laughs> I'm all just like chilling. Thank god I uh, came back. I feel like he took a while to, uh, to spawn in here. Nice. Okay. Okay, now back to the bouncing. I'm gonna basically head over to... Um, Oh, look. Oh, my God. They're marked on my mini map. Do you see that? Do you see that? I didn't even know that that's how it worked. Oh, my God. Okay, so then in that case, we're going to be heading down to Ascara to eat the chocolate. So I'm going to hit this one, this one, this one. Probably like this, this. Hit Ascara down here, this and this. Yeah, we're just going to basically go in a circle. I did not know that it works like that. That is so very, very cool how TomTom Tom works like that. I'm gonna be doing, I'm gonna do another video. I recently unlocked the legacy of Tear Hold, like the quest line, I guess, to like revive Tear. I don't really know that much about it, but I've been like super, super behind on um, Dragonflight stuff. And I've had that unlocked for a few weeks now and I've been waiting to do it because I want to film it when I do it. So maybe a video I'll probably do maybe this week, just kind of like a gameplay slash like live reaction to me doing that quest line because I'm really, really excited about it. And I think that it takes us back to uh, the Whispering Forest in Tears Fall Glades. And if you guys know, I kind of recently-ish did a video on the Whispering Forest. Uh, we did the Dragon Isles world boss. That's good. All right, we're here. We're here in Ascara. All right, it says to eat the chocolates. So we're gonna eat the chocolates. Can't do that while moving. Okay. Yeah, it's working. Five out of 10, just a few more. This one's pretty easy also if you're doing the Noble Garden stuff anyways. Haha, -ha, there we go. 750. That's awesome. Yep. Oh my god, just one more. It's the last one. There it is. Wow, we did it. We did the bouncing. 
That's awesome. Just a hundred more. Oh yeah, use spring flowers in a battleground. Wow. See, I forgot to even do that. I will use the spring flowers. I don't know what that entails. Oh shit, I was taking the selfies and the battleground queue. All right, let's go in to the battleground. Oh my god, I actually love this one. Okay, let's put on the flowers and i guess we'll just see what happens like do i have to actually like attack someone with it that's what i'm assuming use spring flowers in an arena or battleground use them so i guess what what does that mean like use them on someone Shit, i put the bunny ears on i think is that what happened i right clicked them i don't know what that did i don't know if i was i don't know if that was necessary but oh my god it's been forever since i've done a battleground so i'm actually like really excited I'm gonna get on my uh, fox mount. It's it's just cute. Do I have like a Easter themed mount? I don't even know what would be considered Easter themed. I don't think I got a bunny, that's for sure. Maybe we'll get on the, uh, I just got this recently. I like the fox, but we will use the Antorin Gloomhound just because it's epic. I feel like not many people that's a cool ass mount. What the hell? Oh yeah, wait a second. Can I change spec? I want to be beast mastery. That's what I'm supposed to be. All right, let's go. I got to find a victim. Who's going to be victim to my spring flowers? I don't know how to use these flowers on a bitch. Do I just got to whack someone with my flowers? Cast them on someone. I don't know. I'll put it on my bar just so I have it. But uh, here, look, we're going to come up. We're going to come in with the camouflage. Hell yeah, I'm, I wanna... Okay, uh... I, I have the spring flowers on. I shouldn't have done that. Look at that, we got two minutes left. Then I can use the flowers on someone. I will be nice, I will help. For a little bit, just until that cooldown is ready, okay? I'm gonna capture the flag, you little bitch. Look at me go. Just plain sight, just capturing the flag, no big deal, you're welcome. Got 30 seconds left. That's how long I'll help before I'm gonna leave. I want to eat some lasagna before I go to work. I made lasagna for the first time ever. Like for my first time ever making homemade lasagna. It was bomb. Someone is gonna get it. Someone's getting it. Who's getting it? I don't know. This person. Nalabug. Nalabug has got to get it. Yay! I did it! Ha ha ha. I did it. Can I put this on? Yeah, we can. It's like, maybe I'll stay? I don't know. I feel bad leaving. Yeah, I did it. Okay, you know what? Let's just leave. Let's just leave. How do we leave? Leave Battleground. Yes. Someone else could do way better than me in here. I am just fucking around. I did it. I can't believe that I finished everything. I was thinking that I wouldn't be able to, but I feel like that was actually pretty quick. Got it all done in one day, and I didn't even do... Like most of the main ones that I would do. Here, look, we can cross this off. We didn't, we did the one to complete 10 quests, so I only got 50 points for that. We used the spring flowers, we bounced at the critters, but usually I do the dungeon bosses and the raid bosses, and I didn't have to, but those ones are ones that I usually would do. Okay, so let's go ahead, open up our catch. We got the pet, we got all my traders tender. Um, yeah let's see what we're gonna buy uh we don't have much money it's because i always spend like all of it every month uh but i think i really do want the dreadwake boat so i'm gonna purchase it i know that i want it i don't really care much about the turtle but the the boat is pretty cool it's pretty unique okay so we can only buy a few things and remember, I don't have to buy all of them. I think that I always feel like I want to spend all of it, but I really don't have to. Gloves. See? Look at those gloves. Like, I feel like I definitely need those. And then maybe the the cape. You know, the purple cape. Let's do that. Look, we're going to get the purple cape. And then we're also going to get the purple gloves. And then we'll have, like, you know, just a little bit. We'll have 50 tender left for next time. Really just taking it there every month, you know? There we go. Okay, that's that's pretty much. I don't think I want anything else. The rest of it is not really worth it to me. So, yeah, we'll save that 50. And that's what we got. I guess let me um go ahead and get on my new mount just to show it off. The dread wake. Let's open it up. There we go. We did it. 
Oh my god. It's ridiculous. It's so, uh... Wow, what a what a stance we got there. That's pretty cool though. You know, like that's a pretty unique one. I feel like I needed it. All right, so that is all that I've got for you guys. I hope that you enjoyed kind of questing alongside with me, uh, enjoyed me discovering TomTom Tom for the first time and how that works. I think that I might make a new players like noob guide on how to use that because I've been playing WoW for like 16 years and I've never dabbled with TomTom Tom because I think that I always just assumed it was going to be complicated to use so uh, I might kind of learn a bit more about it and kind of figure out all the more like intricate things that you can do with TomTom Tom because I think that that would be super helpful for new WoW players who probably equally find it confusing to use. And if you do use TomTom Tom, and if you have any tips uh, for me, then feel free to comment them down below because I'd love to know more about it. I'm going to go now. I'm going to go eat some lasagna before I head off to work. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!